Well, hello everyone and what a big news for the investors in the stock market. Tesla stock is going to be added to S&P 500, um, something that a lot of investors in the Tesla company have been waiting for such a long time. This is such a huge news for Tesla. In fact, it's going to impact the uh, Tesla stock price uh, drastically for a number of reasons. Uh, first and foremost, uh, just immediate reaction just on the announcement of this news, which uh, came out only about a few hours ago. The stock price post market have gone up by close to 13% or about $50 per share. Um, that's uh, really a good uh, promising sign for Tesla stock and the investors in Tesla stock. Uh, just for a flashback, back in September and as part of the quarterly rebalancing of S&P 500, there were a lot of anticipation and hope that Tesla would have been added to S&P 500 back then. But, um, you know, ultimately the decision at the time was made that Tesla was not going to be added and in instead Etsy was added. As a result of that news, despite some, you know, increase in the stock price before the announcement, the stock really went down by about 20%. Uh, just as a result of that disappointment. So keep that in mind that this is a huge news um, for a lot of investors who uh, are, uh, you know, not only happy about the prestige that um, Tesla would get as a result of being added to S&P 500. S&P 500 is one of the most, uh, you know, prestigious um, indexes out there and, you know, the large 500 largest companies in the US that are publicly traded are actually listed on S&P 500. So the matter of uh, the element of prestige is there. And on top of that, uh, keep in mind that a lot of index funds that are out there, they have S&P 500 as uh, part of their you know, portfolio. And with Tesla shares now being added to S&P 500, that means uh, potentially more volume for the stock. And as a result, it would drive the prices of Tesla stock higher up. For me, Tesla stock is definitely one of the world's most leading, uh, you know, manufacturer of electric cars. In fact, in my opinion, they definitely are, and they're doing phenomenal. In fact, the stock uh, price return is a testament to their amazing uh, performance and how they're doing. Um, just in the past one year alone, the Tesla stock has had close to 500% stock return, and this is even before um, you know the return that um, we are having and seeing post market today. Um, so. With that in mind and really the prospects for being included in the S&P 500 and what's really uh, to come for Tesla stock, I think many investors are so excited about uh, Tesla stock and what uh, they can expect from it. Let's not also forget that a while ago Tesla stock was really um, priced very heavily and they decided that they're going to do some split in their shares and made it even more affordable for a lot of uh, newer investors. Uh, so all of those elements together, put them all together and I think uh, you have a recipe for success for Tesla stock. So um, personally, I think Tesla stock has a huge uh, potential to grow. And in fact, that's something that many of investors um, are alluding to. There are uh, in the news that you could see here, uh, there are investors who are talking about the price target of 500 uh, for Tesla stock in the near future. Um, and with all that you can anticipate with Tesla stock and um, what is expected for it to come, I think you're looking at uh, winning uh, stock in your portfolio if you own this uh, stock. But let us take a few minutes and dive deeper into Tesla stock and its fundamentals and how they're doing in terms of finance and what uh, you can expect and project from their finances in terms of their revenue and earnings per share. As you know, those are some of the elements that influence the future price of the stock and really what you can expect from this company. It's not where this company started, but where it's actually headed that really uh, going to play a part in their stock price. So as you can see here, Tesla indeed uh, has a market capitalization of $387.22 billion and currently has a 52 week range price of between $65.42 to $502.49. Uh, last trading price for the stock was at $408.09, but as I indicated, uh, post-market, after the announcement of Tesla is being uh, you know, added to S&P 500 on December 21st, uh, the stock price has jumped to almost 13% and is uh, showing $463.65 as uh, we speak. One of the pieces of information that was included in the announcement of inclusion in S&P 500 is that given the massive size of Tesla, 
um, being uh, such a um, huge company with 387 plus billion dollars in market cap, uh, there might be a, a possibility that the Tesla uh, stock would be added to S&P 500 in um, pieces, but by December 21st, that should be completed. Um, and S&P 500 would release at a later date what company is going to be removed from the S&P 500 now that Tesla is being added uh, to that index. Looking at the revenue for Tesla for the fiscal year ending in December 2019, they had a total revenue of $24.58 billion. For the year ending in December 2020, uh, the anticipated revenue estimate is to be at $30.72 uh, billion, and this number is going to grow to a massive $44.30 billion in um, the fiscal year of 2021, um, ending in December. That just shows a solid growth in terms of revenue for Tesla stock. One of the other things that I'm quite pleased with uh, when it comes to Tesla and its stock is the fact that this company is uh, actually um, has become already uh, profit making, unlike in the past whereby they were loss making. So, as you could see in the year 2020, their estimated earnings per share is showing to be two dollars and forty cents. This is for non-GAAP and their estimated earnings per share for the year 2021 is expected to be at $3.97. So it um, shows a very uh, solid and nice growth in terms of their earnings per share. Looking at the profitability metrics and in particular the gross profit margin, you can see that for Tesla they have a gross profit margin of 21.14%. They also have a net income margin of 1.97% and a return on equity of 5.59%. Tesla stock has had a phenomenal run in terms of their price momentum and their return. In fact, if you compare that to that of S&P 500, uh, you're gonna notice that Tesla stock's return in over the past three months has been 26% compared to 6.28% return for S&P 500. The six months return for Tesla stock has been 158% plus and uh, you can compare that to only 27% uh, plus return for S&P 500. As for the nine month return, we are seeing 154% for Tesla stock versus 6.26% for S&P 500. And lastly, uh, one year return of 490% compared to only 15.87% return for S&P 500. Just incredible. Well, currently Tesla has uh, just over $15 billion in debt. They also have $14.53 billion in cash. Their average three month stock trading volume has been at 60.25 million shares. I do own several shares of Tesla, but overall I'm quite bullish about Tesla stock and have been adding to my position gradually through fractional shares offered through my brokerage account. I would definitely continue to add to my shares and build a larger uh, portfolio and position of Tesla stocks. Let me know what you think of Tesla and its recent news about being included on the S&P 500 uh, on December 21st. Do you own shares of Tesla in your portfolio? Are you bullish or bearish about Tesla stock? Would love to hear from you. I hope you found this video beneficial. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with someone who might benefit from this video as well. By the way, please don't forget to subscribe to Momentum channel. Here on Momentum channel, we post weekly videos about investing, financial freedom, and stock analysis. Hope to see you next time.